and answer the call at a young age. Yes, yes. And receive all that God has for you at a young age. Yes. That's why God's anointing now generation is so important. Right. Here tonight, amen. I know he's fresh back from the UTC. I know God has done great work in his life. It's you know, it's, it's to see him at the age of 15 and seeing him now. Yes. You can see the work of God all over him. I've been gone for six months. Yeah. And you know, coming back here, a lot of things have changed. You know, when I left, we didn't have the TV screens up. Come on, come on. <laughs> come on. Man. When I left, you know, I didn't see so many new people. Come on, man. You know, a lot of new people that I, I don't know. My name is Brian, if you didn't know. I know. You know, it was a pleasure to meet you. But right through where you're at, if we could just sing a worship song just right quick. Hallelujah. Just begin to worship from right through your church. When you get there, give me a strong amen. Thank you, worship team. Amen. Amen. Before, while you guys are turning in, I have to thank God, first and foremost, for my salvation. You know, for saving me at a young age, like Brother Irvin was saying. I came in young. You know, my dad came into the men's home, and then yeah. shortly after, I came, right. Come on. you know, I stuck my way in there. Come on. But God really grabbed a hold of my life at that time. Right. And, you know, it was a pivotal moment in my life that changed the whole course of my life. Yeah. You know, so I'd like to thank God for my salvation. Yeah. And I also like to thank God, you know, for our pastor, Pastor Francisco. Yeah. 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 You know, for all the all what they do, all what they right. do behind the scenes, right, right here behind the pulpit, right. the messages, everything that they do. So serious right there with the kids game right now. See all those things. Yeah, yeah. You know, I'm grateful for it. Yeah. You know, for always right. teaching me, discipling me. Amen. And you know, and last but not least, I thank my parents. Amen. My Ooh. parents, my family. Come on. Come on, come on. That's the only thing I learned Spanish when I was over there. I think my, my parents, you know, for bringing me to this awesome ministry. If it wasn't for them coming, I would not be here in front of you guys here tonight. Come on, come on. So if you're there, give me a strong amen. Amen. Hallelujah. The Bible reads like this. Let us fix our eyes on Jesus, the author and the perfecter of our faith. Who for the joy set before him endured the cross, scorning his shame, and sat down at the right at the right hand of the throne of God. Consider him who endured such opposition from sinful man, so that you will not grow weary and lose heart. Come on. You may be seated here tonight. You now the title of the message is Joy to the World. Joy to the World. You see, I want you to ask yourself a question here tonight. It is a simple question. What is joy? I want, you, I want everybody just to think about that question. Chew on that question a little bit. Just chew on it. What is joy? What is joy? Why are people so joyful during this time of year? Come on. It's Christmas. You know, other times of year, everybody's like the Grand Chill of somebody. <laughs> but all of a sudden, this time of year, Christmas time, Everybody's all joyful, all happy. Have you ever asked yourself why? Why that is? I, I, I have. I have. The reason, the reason I can think of is the fact that they're doing something for somebody else. Oh, come on. Oh, that's good. Come on. That they're doing something for somebody man, man. else. They're not thinking about themselves yeah, in this yeah. time of year. Yeah, yeah. They're not thinking about their agenda this time of year. But no, everybody's worried about, oh, look at the gift. I got a little Susie. Come on. They're not looking at, oh, look at the J's I just bought. Come on, oh, y'all. come on. <laughs> you know, the, the way people talk during this time of season, it changes. Right. It changes from them. It changes from them to they. Right, right. It change, their talk changes a little bit during this time of year. Come on. 
You know, but the real reason for this season is our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Yes. Right. Yes. Come on. It's our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. That's right. That's good. You see, you read in the scripture that he took joy. He had joy in doing yes. the cross. Yes, yes. That's good. That's good. Enduring the cross. That's good, that's good. For our sins. Come on, yeah. For our iniquity. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. For us for our situation. Yeah, 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 yeah. Our problems. Tell us some You know, he took joy in it. Because he died for you and I. That's yes. right. Come on. At that moment, at that moment, it didn't seem so joyful. Come on. At that moment, it didn't seem like. Everything was, is going good. But deep down, he had a joy. Yes, he yeah, had a yeah. joy taking the cross for our sins. Yeah. He had a joy walking down. Walking down, carrying the cross on his back. Yeah. Watching them. Yelling at them. You see, Jesus had a joy. That's right. And I always wondered, I'm like, why? Why? Because I'm, I'm a nobody. I'm nobody. Come on. But God gave me an answer. He gave me an answer. He took joy in it Come on. to give us joy. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah. That's absolutely right. When we're in the world, I don't know too many people that have real joy in the world. Come on, Come on. now. It's good. They have happiness. They have happiness, yes. But there's a difference. Yes. There's a difference between joy and happiness. Yeah. You know, and that already brings me to my first point here tonight. Joy is different from happiness. Yes. That's right. It is. It's good. It really is. Come on. You see, joy is something much more deeper than happiness. Yes, come on. yes, It's yeah, deeper come on. than happiness. Break it down. See, happiness is just an emotion. Come on, yes. Come on. It's just an emotion. It comes yeah, yeah. and goes. Yeah. It comes and goes. On. One minute you're happy, next minute you're, you're sad. Wow. Come on. Happiness comes and goes. But joy, on the other hand, joy is a little different. Come on. Joy is different. See, joy is something you have deep down inside of you. That no matter what's going on in your life, Come on. you know you have some type of joy. Woo! You know you have some type of peace. Yeah, 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 because yeah. Jesus Christ came and he saved you, on, redeemed right. you. You see, you have that. You have that joy. You see, it's different from happiness. You see, when you think about the Lord, Come on. I, I love that song. When I think about the Lord Come on now. and what He's done for me, yeah, 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 yeah. when I think about His goodness Come on. and how He sets me free, Come on. it makes me want to run. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. It makes me want to jump. Come on. Yeah. It makes me want to spin around. Yeah. When you think about the Lord yes. Come on. and all He's done in your life, yes. when you yes. think about Thank it, you Jesus. Come on. when you just think about it, yes. the mess that you are in, Come on. the bondage that you are in, yes. 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 nobody else can take you out of it. Nobody else can take you out of it. Yes. one day that God, yeah. that Jesus, yes. Yes. You know, I was happy. Mm. I just received a breakthrough. You know, and there's these group of people. Come on. That they're all just negative. Oh my, mm. oh my God. They're Come just on. negative. I was like, I just got out of prayer. I'm, I'm still crying, walking Come out of my room. Come on. I'm still crying, still broken. <laughs> right. And then I walk to the door. Yeah. And I look over, and they're just, they're just sitting there. Oh my. Oh, oh, sad. Oh, I don't know. Come on. Come <laughs> on. I took it upon myself. Hello, somebody. Hey, Come on. Come on. And I was like, negative. I just told him, just like that. Negative. But then the Lord had to slap my face because I didn't know that one of the persons there was actually having an asthma attack. 
I didn't know. I thought it would be negative. I, I really thought, like, they're trying to steal my joy right now. Come on. They're trying to steal my joy with God's day in my life. They're trying to steal it. And I'm not going to let that happen, so I'm just going to avoid them. But one of the persons in the group was actually having an asthma attack, and I felt so bad afterwards. <laughs> I felt so bad afterwards. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to, but I wasn't gonna let nobody try to steal my joy. Come on, come on, man. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's a funny story. She, that person's okay now. That person's okay now. <laughs> but at that moment, she really wasn't. She really wasn't. I was like, I was like, what? They trying to steal my joy. Come on. I just got a prayer. Yeah, yeah. Has anybody just ever just got a prayer? Oh, come on, come on, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. just got a prayer. You know, you had a little, you had a little, um, a prayer moment where you just had to step away just for a little bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Come on. You just had to step away just for a little bit and grab hold of the Lord. Right. Has right. anybody else had that moment? Yeah. And then you got up. Mm. And then you got up. With the joy of the Lord, help us. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And you yeah, got yeah. up, not feeling the same way you went down. Come on, come on. Yeah. And you got up, walking around with a new sense of joy. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I share that here to tell you this. It's my second point. I know I'm flying through this, but there's a reason, there's a reason. Come on, come on. Is that joy provides strength. Yeah, 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 that's right. right. Joy provides strength. Don't the joy of the Lord. Oh. And Nehemiah 8.10. Nehemiah 8.10. If we can turn there. Turn your Bible with me to Nehemiah 8.10. <laughs> Hello, hallelujah. It's on the screen? Okay, it's on the screen. It says, Nehemiah said... Go and enjoy choice food and sweet drinks and send some to those who have nothing prepared. This day is holy to our Lord. Do not grieve, for the joy of the Lord is your strength. Yes. Come on, come on, come on. Well, you know, I don't know, I don't know how many of us in here have felt like their day was not so good. That their day was not so good. That they had a bad day at work, hello somebody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, for the parents, the kids are acting up. Hello. And you, it's just not a good day. You woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Hello. You could have woke up late and had to rush to work. So you didn't really get time to pray. That Because it happens. That happens. But one thing that always stuck out to me was that the joy of the Lord is my strength. Come on, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's my strength. Yeah. I know for a moment, I may be feeling a little down. Come on. For just a moment. For just a moment. Amen. Come on. Amen. For just a moment. Because it's not going to last all Yes, come on. It's not going to last all I want to know that I just got to get down on my knees. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just got to get down on my knees and just, right. and just pray it, a little bit. Yes, and yes, seek yes. after God a little bit. Right. And get right. camped in His presence just a little bit. Yes, yes, yes. You yeah. see, and then I come up with a new sense of strength. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes, What's yes. The... But you, you're in the right place here tonight. Hey, yes. Hey, bye. You're in the right place here tonight. Where God is going to be able to give you that joy. Another thing that comes with joy is a peace. Yes. It's a peace. Yes. yes. You, may, you may come into this place a lot of peace. I don't know the circumstances. I just got back three days ago. Hello, somebody. Come on, come on. That's right. So I may not know everything that's going on right now. But I can tell you this. The Lord put in my spirit that there's some people that need to experience some joy. Yeah, man, man. Come on, bro. There's some people that need to experience some peace. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know who you are. I don't know. I'm just delivering a message. Come on, come on. Thank you, thank you. I'm just delivering a message. Some, some of us walked in these doors tonight not knowing why you came, not knowing the purpose of you being here. You know, somebody invited you maybe a long time ago, a couple weeks ago, but you chose today to show up. 
It's not by accident. Amen. It's not by coincidence. Amen. That's right. That you're sitting in these seats. That you're sitting to the, and listening to the message. It's not by accident. That's right. It's not by accident. See, God wants to give you His joy. Yes. yes. Right. His joy. Amen. Not happiness that the world can give. Come on. No, but a joy that's internal. A joy that's everlasting. A joy. That's right. But you got to be willing. Yes. To accept it. Yes. You got to be willing to accept it. I believe in God here tonight. Yes. For some people to walk out of this place with the joy of the Lord. Amen. I'm believing in God here tonight for some miracles that you walked in not feeling the joy of the Lord. You walked in oh, yes. not, not having peace. You walked in, you may have felt hopeless. You may feel hopeless. You don't know the situation that you're in. You don't know what's going to happen. But I'm here to let you know, Victor Howard's Grand Prairie. Come on. That you're gonna leave this place with the joy of the Lord. Yes. yes. That you're gonna leave this place with the joy. A joy that surpasses all understanding. A peace that surpasses all understanding. Here tonight. Here tonight. You gotta be willing. Willing. Willing to accept that joy. As we all stand here tonight. God is on the move here tonight. God is on the move tonight. We got to understand something. That all you have to do is to be still. Don't be in a rush. Don't be in a hurry. Because God wants to move here tonight. God wants to move. You may came in. You're like, I have, I have this situation. I have this situation. I have this problem. Where is the joy in that? Where is the joy in the situation I'm facing? But I'm here to let you know that Jesus had joy when he died for you and I. Oh, good for you.
the outlet of his joy. Hallelujah. Of his joy. Yes. His joy. Hallelujah. I say it again, his joy. Yes. But some of us here tonight, we don't feel that joy. Come on, come on. Be honest. We don't feel that joy. I'm here to let you know, don't leave this place. Yeah, that's right, that's right. Go home and do something. Right there, I just left your hand.